हेलो एवरीवन एंड वेलकम बैक टू दीक्षा कर्नाटक का यूट्यूब चैनल एंड हियर आई एम विद द मोस्ट अवेटेड वीडियो ऑफ ऑल द पीयू बोर्ड स्टूडेंट्स दैट हाउ कैन यू स्कोर 95 प्लस इन लेस देन 30 डेज व्हाट शुड बी माय स्ट्रेटजी व्हाट शुड बी माय प्लान्स इफ इवन इफ यू हैव नॉट येट स्टार्टेड योर जर्नी हाउ कैन यू स्टिल स्कोर नाइन्टी percent plus physics is very very uh, difficult subject for most of the students and some students think okay it is slightly difficult for some students they think it is uh, okay it is difficult and i don't think anyone uh, in my uh, subscriber base they will say physics is easy right so without any delay let's start with today's lecture today's presentation not i will not say this is a lecture this is basically a uh, um, advice is that i want to give you first of all what you have to do you have to never 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 give up so if even if you feel that physics is difficult physics is tough okay physics i will fail you can not give up on the dream of scoring well in physics getting a good rank in your kset exam so for that pu board marks are important you cannot skip it so you cannot give up on this right so uh, this is the must thing from your heart within yourself even if you are depressed i know many of you are going through the many difficulties of your uh, pre adulthood there are a lot of challenges i know but here last few months last one month one and half month are left before most critical exam of your life that is your pu board final is going to come uh, so don't give up right now continue study study harder if you are studying for 5 hours now you study for 8 hours if you are study for 8 hours now you have to study for 10 hours slowly you have to increase and you have to study more and more all the subjects including physics okay don't stay behind in physics now is the time to study right now how can we uh, utilize the remaining time and how can we uh, utilize the resources pretty well so first of all cover the entire syllabus okay how can you cover the entire physics syllabus in 30 days so first of all i have prepared 14 very precise videos for your entire pu board syllabus that is brahmastra series all the important questions all the important concepts all the topics are discussed there so this is a must watch for all the pu board student if you have not watched it go and watch them today okay the link of the playlist will be there in the uh, uh, down below all the subjects are there you can choose physics from there and you can watch it okay next decode ncr this is a ongoing series where i am trying to help you how you can read your ncert better how can you develop the concept so even if you have not started again we will be completing this ncert series very soon so follow that series along with your ncert book to build up the concepts if you have not yet started so if you have not if you are someone who has not yet opened the book at all you are just relying on your friends to copy from here and there and somehow you are getting some marks and your parents are scolding that oh you will fail in physics then you should start with this series this should be your starting point once suppose you are studying electric charges and fields so first you go and uh, watch my video on ncert decode ncert electric charges and field after you watch the video you open the book uh, mark obviously you have to read the uh, book along with this uh, series and then you can go back to brahmastra series and check all the important questions and how many of you of them you can able to answer it so that is the main 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 resource for physics okay i have also done a lot of videos in kset series you can check them if you want if you are someone who is already scoring 60 70 marks and you want to score that 95 mark percent marks 99 percent marks then you have to check some of the kset videos as well okay so uh, i am assuming that if you are scoring 60 70 percent then you are already watching my brahmastra series you have already watched my decode ncert series then go and check my kset series as well from there you can build up on the difficult level of question uh, uh, thinking skills right so difficult questions will be easier 
now question practice from where we should practice the questions we should practice the questions there are uh, previous year questions if you have the previous year questions for pu board with you very good if you don't have you can purchase one of these books jeevit and legend both are very good okay they all have uh, mentioned the previous years what are the important questions and ncert in text is one of the uh, main resources obviously decode ncert is there for you to help out with the ncert in text you don't need to study the entire ncrt okay even some of the ncrt is not well organized for that you have to check my decode ncrt series model papers there are three model papers and also one model question bank uh, released by pu board recently there they have a lot of questions you can check them if you have time if you don't have time uh, then you can uh, rely on my brahmastra series where i have discussed all the important questions and for mcqs there will be surprise for you okay very soon I will not discuss about MCQs but MCQ will also be covered don't worry we have so far we have al uh, already covered a part of MCQ in Brahmastra but definitely we are going to take care of MCQs separately now what else how can you revise all the chapters quickly just before exam so you have to make this preparation right now so you have to prepare a list of all the important derivations okay Gauss's law the what is the electric field due to a straight wire at some point so you have to make a formula sheet for yourself okay all the important derivations and their uh, corresponding formulas okay maybe small two marks for derivation maybe three marks derivation maybe uh, five mark derivation all the derivations and their formulas it will very very handy uh, for all the future preparations including competitive exams what is next important laws make a list of all the important laws coulomb's law coulomb's law everyone knows but when it is asked coulomb's law in vector form most student don't know that you have to draw a diagram in this case right so those things you have to know those things you have to remember right so these are the important part next selected numericals i suggest the four chapters from where uh, the numericals you have to practice i have uh, completed one uh, lecture on this uh, that going live today uh, if you are watching after that you can uh, uh, go and check that video so we have already discussed or uh, there will be one more video uh, from uh, for numericals so two chapters are already covered two chapters i will cover in next uh, week but these four chapters i suggest as the primary target for your numericals if you are someone who is having difficulty to answer numericals you have to focus on these four chapters only from these four chapters you will definitely get two numericals common right if you have more time you can practice other chapters as well but these are the four main chapters from where two numericals are sure shot okay now next what should you do in the 30 days that I am saying about so in the 30 day plan I will share a day wise plan don't worry first of all you have to focus on high weightage chapters okay so you have to know which chapters are very high weightage from where you can expect at least 70 percent 60 percent 80 percent marks 60 to 80 percent marks are coming from those high weightage chapters so 50 percent of your time is reserved for those high weightage chapters then medium weightage chapter you will spend seven days okay and then low weighted chapters there are a few low weighted chapters for that you have to spend three days and a revision five days so total 30 days it is a complete package everything you have to do it and this is only for physics alongside it you have to make time for chemistry make times for biology make times for uh, other subjects mathematics as well obviously mathematics is very very important so all subjects you have to accommodate and at least uh, two to three hours you have to spend right now if you have not uh, studied before right two to three hours minimum every day with a fixed time okay from the morning I will practice mathematics then I will do uh, chemistry then I will do physics then I will biology then again I will practice some maths then physics like that so you have to make a daily timetable okay not chapter wise but at least you have to make a timetable of uh, what you are going to do when okay also alongside this you may have tuitions you may have to go to college some days right so uh, uh, practical exams are coming then your pre-board exams are coming so you have to go to colleges uh, or nowadays as well but whenever you are home you have to pre prepare well right now no time wasting from now on what else now this is a day wise plan you have to follow this plan okay 
and uh, the first we are going to discuss high weightage chapter what are all the high weightage chapters uh, electric charges and field very very important chapter so you have to spend three days this is the first chapter a lot of concepts are there a lot of important numericals are there so three days you can spend on this chapter but not any day more than three three days you have to complete all the important concepts all the important topics and write them practice them next is four to five uh, that is uh, number day number four to day number five that is two days you have to spend for electrostatic potential and capacitance this is also a very important chapter another two days you are going to spend on current electricity this is also a very important chapter one derivation is uh, almost coming from this chapter then a, another two days moving charges and magnetism another important chapter lot of small 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 questions are coming from this then alternating current two days this is a very important chapter and and from here you can expect one numerical definitely right then again or ray optics and optical instrument again you spend two days this is important for theory this is important for uh, numericals as well so this is also a very very important chapter what else uh, medium weighted chapters there are few medium weighted chapters magnetism and matter small chapter you can finish it in one day wave optics slightly difficult ch chapter but it is a medium weighted chapter so you can spend two days to complete this chapter because this level, the level of difficulty to complete this chapter is slightly more okay and then again another two days you have to complete dual nature of radiation and matter another medium important and medium difficult chapters so not super difficult again semiconductor electronics from here you are uh, expected to get one five mark uh, 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 long answer type question confirmed so you have to prepare this this chapter well right so these are the medium weighted chapters now let's look into the low weighted chapters electromagnetic wave you can finish it like uh, this it is a very small and small weighted chapter uh, atoms and nuclei even though the people pay a lot of attention in these two chapters but this only three or four marks is coming from this chapter so don't waste too much time on these two chapters you have to keep them for the last okay or what you can do in between a difficult chapter you can prepare a low weightage or medium weightage chapter in between that is a smart pro tip that i can i can give you but if you don't want to do that you want to finish i am very weak i am just starting now then focus on your high weightage chapter even if you are not completing your medium weightage and low weightage chapters if you are starting now that is fine but high weightage chapters must be completed if you are someone who is doing it their second or third revision okay already syllabus is completed then when you are doing the revision what you have to do you have to in between two high weightage chapter you can sandwich a medium weightage chapter that is fine okay but you have to keep a last four five days for revision only what you will do in revision in the revision it is not about the reading from the book you will open a uh, question paper and try to answer it okay uh, we have launched pew uh, two test series success blueprint pew two test series if you have not yet subscribed to that you can subscribe to that uh, there otherwise you can find a question paper from uh, different public publishers or from the uh, board sample papers okay board there are three sample papers already there so you have to find them start writing them practice writing okay that is very very important and you see if you are able to finish it within the three hour time limit that is very 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 important okay when i was a student i used to write at least one test in one week okay so one test in one week is mandatory for each subject so that is very 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 important that will give you an idea okay whether i am able to complete it or not next is what how to use Diksha Karnataka channel very 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 important we have all the resources all the size covered for your pure board so first of all concepts you can watch 60 out of 60 Diksha cassette series all the concepts are covered in detail in depth uh, so this is for the students who are very very really aiming high okay otherwise for question practice all the 85 percent questions are covered in our brahmastha series everything is covered all the important questions are covered all the chapters are covered so definitely this is a must watch this is the most important part of your preparation next word for the last finishing you have decode ncrt okay if whatever concepts are left over or if you are just starting now this should be your starting point then you will go to brahmastha series but if you have already 
already completed everything and you want to go in slightly more detail then this should be your order of uh, topic following right next is for mastering mcq definitely definitely we will bring you a surprise so that is under the wraps till now okay so i am i cannot discuss about it but definitely we will going to help you with mcqs as well next for practice test as i said there is a paid test we have launched uh, pu2 success blueprint test series uh, that is available only for 599 you can add my personal code uh, sam100 to get an extra 100 rupees off on that 599 rupees so everything is available for 499 it is currently going on and the link for that is given in the description if you want you can purchase that otherwise you can find uh, any textbook from there you can practice that is also fine now if you have liked this video don't forget to share with your friends so that our subscriber increases and obviously give it a like i'll be back with more videos in future